Hi, I'm Steve Heinrich. I'm one of the four stage managers here at the uh, Wharton Center. I'm a member of IETSE Local 274, the Stage Hands Union. I've been working since 1977 on campus and other venues. Uh, I was an on-call stagehand and a head carpenter here until 2011 when I uh, took a full-time job as a stage manager. And I've been on and off working in the theater and rock and roll and all that jazz for most of my adult life. So in no other world except the Wharton Center would they put the sound booth for a 2400 seat theater at the far end of the balcony. And it's, the only thing that would be worse is to put the sound engineer in a soundproof glass booth <laughs> underneath a balcony. So cool thing about this though, once we got that issue settled, and that was a big project, was putting in our sound bunker. Um, if you look up, there's two holes in that cloud right there. And in the ceiling above it, we had to hand carry pretty much a winch, a drum about this big. And that sat up there and had some diverters and cables came down through those two holes, ran down to the stage, a couple more diverters, and then there was a cable that dropped right at center stage and when Mary Poppins was here, and this is, I think, the last show that they did it, hmm. that they flew her, they hooked her up and she popped her umbrella and she flew right up here. And that winch dropped her right down here in this booth like it was programmed to do. And then we built this door, so this is all filled with uh, happy theater doors. We built this temporary door and put a little uh, diaper around it so the people sitting up here couldn't see. And uh, she had like two or three wardrobe people and probably a stage manager. And they grabbed her, and this is one of my favorite things. It's one of the most trivial things, but she had to fly up here, and then she had to appear down on deck for the bios. And you guys know that that's three stories down. Um, from where we came in here all the way, she had a, all the way backstage to the brown elevator. So uh, a wardrobe person would have the elevator there locked off. The best part was, is that the uh, road wardrobe ladies put up signs through the grand tier. Run, Mary, run. Run, Mary, run. It's bows, run, Mary, run. And I thought those were so cool that I wanted to leave them up permanent. We did leave them up for a couple weeks.